Well, I'm basically a science teacher and uh, biology, physics, chemistry, computer science, electronics. So I have an interesting background that blends both the hardcore probability statistics, uh, physics, electronics, with the biological. And it turned out to be a very special mix that allowed us to do wonderful things, contributing greatly to the environment with students of all levels from uh, both university all the way down to early high school. One of the things that I made a point of doing when I was at the high school level was taking young people and turning them onto science and turning them onto the environment in particular, hoping that they would make careers in science in different ways. So I spent uh, well over a decade getting contracts and hiring the best science people from across the city to do scientific projects and contributing to the environment. In order to um, survive change, we need richness in the ecosystem, both genetically and we need species richness. If we look across this planet, we see the biodiversity is disappearing. In fact, many scientists tell us that we are living the another great period of extinction. And if we are going to undergo planetary changes that we have to adapt to, then we need ecosystem richness, both genetic diversity and species richness. And I just don't see it. It's hard to keep it. Uh, I'm working very hard to try and do what I can. Uh, but remember that I'm only really the front man for hundreds of other people that I work with. A person that contributes to the environment is a very happy person. A person that is able to rejoice in the success of others will be happy forever. A person that only rejoices in its own accomplishments will not rejoice very often and will not be happy very often. So if you can join a collective force and improve in some minor or major way the environment in which you live, then you have made a contribution that will make you proud, that will introduce you to a sector of our community that is filled with wonderful, wonderful people. People that are willing to give and not only receive. People that are willing to work for others and not just work for themselves. And it will create, I think, as it has for me, a much richer life than it would be had I not been involved with all these wonderful people, working together with these wonderful people, trying to make our community a better and richer place.